Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I am going to show how to perform uh, the transient analysis of a two-stage OTA. Basically, a transient analysis is quite uh, important because of the transient analysis calculate the response of a circuit over a period of time that uh, defined by user. Also, it is important because uh, to observing how a circuit behaves during the startup. So. Before going to start, I have to launch the ADL. I already launched the ADL, but here, here change that's if you want to place click Q, then you can show and show you that here is a two thing. Two thing I have to change. One is the amplitude, which is which is basically one millivolt, and the frequency which I take ten kilohertz. Mm. So it's a it's uh, 0 0.1 millisecond the period is 0 0.1 millisecond the frequency is 10 kilohertz well and this for the one differential signal and another differential signal which is also same as but here is a change that's polarity is changed if you are not changed the polarity then you have to you have to uh, you have to make a 180 degree phase delay because it's a differential signal that's why you have to uh, create and you have to set a phase delay here i already changed the polarity you can see see here here is a positive uh, sig connected to the positive polarity and another is a negative polarity that's why i don't need to change the phase also all things are okay and then i plus the adl to to perform the ac analyze tangent analysis you have to set here the transient transient then here, here i said the stop time is one millisecond because i i'm going to show uh 10 cycle that's because my frequency is 0 point, uh, 10 kilohertz and the period is 0 0.1 millisecond if i plot the 10 cycle then the stop time will be one millisecond and the accuracy level is moderate and please try to click here for enable and no. To plot the signal, I have to set the plot to be plotted on selector design. Then I have to plot in output. Here is the unwanted node is selected. Let's try to delete that. Well. The output is taken and then I have to plot the differential signal 1 and signal 2. And then let's rename the signal. Then this is output. This is the output. Turn to the end. Output. This is optional. If you are not interested to rename, then there is no problem. Okay, then run the simulation. You can see here. Also, so another thing. Let's rename the net name. It will be give us an extra benefit.
करते हैं again i need to select the net see what plus let's set it in again Okay, output we plot is select on design. Yeah, the benefit is that here the level will be shown to analyze is will be easier for us. So here here is the input plus and input minus. You can see here this those differential signal is 180 degree apart from each other here is the uh, phase shift is 180 degree by the way this is the output and now the output is also sinusoid sine wave sinusoid waves by the way if you, if you are interested to find the gain from the transient analysis you can get the gain from here so how to how to get the gain let's set the graph properties first okay to find the gain this a triple sheet First, I need a signal, output signal. Let's set calculator, tools calculator. Set the wave, then find the peak. Okay. The peak to be values is that nine six one point six to the power nine and two three. So Okay, let's find the input. In this sign, let's find the input. Again, it came over. Two point zero oil now the input is both same. Let's make the Average differential voltage. If this is the same voltage, the average will be same. But if if this are not same, then you have to make it average. It's better to find the average. Let me show you. No, 
Let's find the kid. You didn't hear his kid. Output by input. This is a linear scale, and if you are interested to make in DB scale, then you have to set twenty intro. If there is a lock function. So make it in a db scale, 20 db but dk, then 20 into log the ddl hello base is 10 bits. Yeah, this is 53. As, as you remember that we get the gain in AC response, which is basically 53 db. In this way, you can find the gain of your uh, OTA from the tangent analysis. Also, you can get the gain from here as you wish to find the gain in here, which also is here. Uh, the scale plater waves. Turn to the stack and find the input divided by it. The gain is sorry, and the insult, then peak to peak hello, then send it to this tag. Again, Uh, this is the linear value. Find it in db scale. Yeah, 53.64. Thank you for watching this tutorial.